Worst case scenario, we pick up all the balls and have to do it again. Don't try this at home. Mm -mm. Liquid nitrogen is dangerous and so is your lack of safety precautions. Hey, Mauricio and David here for a Distort Quickie. Yep, so we played around with liquid nitrogen in a previous episode showing how you can rapidly freeze organic products. Mm -hmm. What we haven't done is take advantage of the rapidly changing states of being that liquid nitrogen can also have. That's right. For example, the fact that it has an expansion rate of one to 694, meaning it expands fairly quickly from liquid to gas. And if you have it in any confined space, it's gonna be a lot of pressure creating. Yeah, for example, if you take about a cup and a half of liquid nitrogen into a liter bottle and seal the top. Graham, you ready for triggering? I'm ready. Is it a third of the way up bottom. Nope. How about now? Nope. Nothing, not even close? Not even close. All right, and here it goes. Safety precautions say never put liquid nitrogen into a sealed container. And that's exactly what we did. Yeah, that means if you take a liter bottle and put a cup and a half of liquid nitrogen in it and close the lid, that cup and a half turns into maybe about a thousand cups of gas. Mm -hmm. The math says a little bit over a thousand. So our 30 gallon trash can was immediately overwhelmed with displaced air and sent our 1800 ping pong balls flying all over the place. Yeah, science. For science. We would like to thank YouTube Space LA for providing us with the stage where we set off this little nitrogen explosion, as well as to uh, Eileen Rivera down there, uh, Mike Baca, who came down and helped us shoot, as well as Graham Hancock right behind the camera here now. Uh, comment below, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. How many frames did you shoot this at? 300. And this is playing at half of them. Yeah. How many do you think are stuck in that catwalk? <laughs> I don't know.